Hello everyone, how are you all? I hope you all are fine. In the previous video, we have learned the matter, states of matter and concepts of molecules and atom. Today, we are going to learn about the changes in the state of matter. Okay? Change of a state. Matter can change from one state to another on heating or cooling and you know there are three state of matter that is solid liquid and gas heating and cooling heating and cooling bring about changes in matter some changes are temporary while others are permanent Basically, there are two types of changes and they are physical changes and chemical changes. Let's have a look on these changes in detail. First is physical change. A physical change is a temporary change which can be reversed. As from the name only physical appearance of the matter changes, not the chemical. Let's have some important points related to physical changes. Okay, so first is changes that takes place is temporary. Changes that takes place only in the state of matter. That means only its Physical properties or appearance changes like its shapes, size, color, volume, etc. But not the chemical properties changes. And the third one is the changes that takes place can be reversed also. Okay, let's check out some examples of physical changes. So see here. Freezing of water. When water cools or freeze, it becomes ice. Okay? When you reverse it, that is melting of water. Now what comes here? Ice melts after heating and becomes water. Third example is evaporation of water. In which water when heated it changes into water vapor and fourth example is condensation of water in this water vapor when cools down it changes back into water let's have a look on these examples in detail okay so first we have a beaker filled of water that is liquid when the water is cooled down it means when water is kept in a freezer it changes into ice that is solid here you can see how this water changes its state of matter that is from liquid to solid this is a physical change okay and the process of changing a liquid into solid is called freezing. This physical change can be reversed also. How? Let's see. Now when ice is kept out of refrigerator or kept in a warm place, it starts melting and becomes water. And this process of changing of solid into liquid on heating is called melting. Okay, now let's see what we conclude. So you will see in a picture, water is in liquid state. When it cools down, it becomes ice that is in solid state. And when you heat the ice, it comes back in water that is in liquid state now when this liquid 
is again heated it changes into water vapor which is in gaseous state and the process is known as evaporation now when the water vapor touches a cold surface it changes into water and the process changing a gas or a water vapor into a liquid on cooling is condensation okay okay now take an example of a candle see in the picture here candle is in the form of solid wax but when it is heated or lighted it starts melting as you can see it is the temporary change we can reverse it how this melted wax after cooling becomes solid wax next is chemical changes in a chemical change heating or cooling result in a permanent change in the state of matter and a new substance is formed when and a new substance is formed and we cannot get the old substance let's see some examples when a piece of paper is burned it changes into ash some smoke is released yes okay the molecules of paper are different from the molecules of ash here you can conclude that this change is a chemical change okay let's see some other examples also burning of a match sticks cooking of a food formation of curd from milk can you get back the match stick that is burned no you can't get back so these are the example of chemical changes so let's see some properties so what do you conclude from these examples that chemical changes are permanent changes we cannot obtain the original or old substance this change cannot be reversed when the chemical changes takes place the end result we obtain is not the old substance but we get a new substance so this was all about physical and chemical change of different states of matter if you like this video please like share and subscribe my channel